So the day I'm replacing the front wheel hubs on this 2013 Chevy Malibu. It's cold out here, so let's get right to it. You want to begin by jacking up the front end and supporting it with jack stands. Then remove the wheels with the 22mm socket. We'll need to remove the caliper, so put the key in the accessory position and turn the wheel to gain better access to your fasteners. Slide the brake line off this bracket so it'll have more slack and use a 14mm socket to remove both caliper bolts. I tied the caliper to the strut assembly so it's out of the way. Now we need to remove the caliper bracket. There's two bolts holding it in place and you'll need a 21 millimeter socket for removal. My rotor is now free to slide off because the retaining screw is missing, but normally you'll need to remove the screw with a T30 Torque screwdriver or a socket. You'll need an 18mm deep socket to remove this tie rod in. Now you'll need a 32 millimeter socket to remove the axle nut. We have to remove the two strut bolts and you'll need an 18 millimeter wrench to hold the bolt with an 18 millimeter socket to loosen the nut. Now we have complete access to the three fasteners for the hub assembly and you'll need that 18 millimeter socket for removal again. I reconnected the steering knuckle to the strut assembly and used a bolt to hold it in place because I have no slide hammer, hub buster, etc. So it's good old fashioned hammer time. Installation is reversal removal, but before installing your new wheel hub, you want to clean the area and apply a little anti-seize to the mating surface. 